All right, what's up, guys? So uh, we're in Biloxi. I got uh, Douglas and Anna and Little Dog and James, and that's Bree. She's new. Hey, Bree. All right, so uh, we stayed here last night at where are we? The Palace, the Palace Casino Resort thing. And uh, nice room. Got in late. Didn't have time to film anything. Um, but anyway, we're gonna get a different hotel for tonight so that we can hang out and swim and do things. But they just adjusted the rates up to like almost four hundred dollars a night, and I don't want to pay that again. So here we go. gonna suck but uh waffle house it's a thing hey douglas douglas just put coilovers on his car me you can see that he's tightened the gap up a little bit here my hair's up i missed the spot so we were gonna do waffle house but then we realized there's a hundred waffle houses so we're gonna try to find somewhere to eat along the beach yes. and we took the top off Have you been here? Have you ever been to Lucy's? No, but I got inside James first. No. All right. Anna said we should record inside since we got funny stuff last time. Why not? There's All right. Table right there, straight in. All right. All right. So we got our new friend Bree with us here today, and we found out. Okay, so Bree has a thing with eating in public, and we're trying to figure out why. <laughs> Hi Bree. What you what you do with eating in public? I don't eat in public. Like I just I don't like it. Like what is it about it? Is it something? I is it some people like like people watching you eat freaks yeah. you out? Because like I could understand that. Yeah, I just don't like it. I feel like people judge me, so I don't eat in public. Do you chew with your mouth open or something? No, no, okay. Not at all. Or is it like they judge you because you use your feet to eat or something? I don't use my feet to eat. I mean no, but I just I don't know. Yeah, so Anna Anna says that eating meat is like eating dead animal pieces and she can't deal with it. It doesn't work for me. It, it's detestable. So everywhere we go, she just eats uh, french fries. Like french fries, maybe a pickle. I don't know. All right, thank you. Thank you, Bree, for letting us interrogate you about why you don't eat in public. Now we By the way, the lighting's really good. Look, you look really good. Check that out. See, we can't film Anna because she has the light behind her. Yeah. Well, John, did you post something on your uh, Snapchat story? What'd you post? I posted a lot of things, actually. No, what'd you post about something about a relationship? I didn't post anything about a relationship. What was it? Anna told me that that you did one of those slide up anonymous things and someone was asking you about who you like. People asking me too many questions. Okay, let me, let, me, let me throw something out there. So, on social media, when people put something out there like, hey, ask me something, and then they ask you something, do you think that you'd be entitled to be upset that they asked you something? Yes, they ask me something. They ask me a lot of things. I get asked one question, but a million of them, Slide up and say something. Okay, hold on, hold on. I don't really care what. Slide up and say something, I don't care what. And then you got mad because people are asking you. I'm getting mad because the same person's constantly asking me questions. How do you know if it's the same person? It just sounds like Yeah, how do you know? Like, what group of people is going to get together and be like, yeah, let's all ask them a bunch of questions? It doesn't have to be a group of people. It could just be somebody seeing it go, oh, what about this? I'm saying something is because it reminds me of these girls that post a picture of like, oh my god, I'm so fat, and they're in a bikini and a thong or like some crap like that on their story. Yeah, like if I posted a picture of myself in this, oh, and it was like, oh my god, I'm fat. 
Yeah, and then you get all offended when people are like, you're sexy. Oh my god, I can't believe you said that. Yeah, like sexy. if I had a bunch of guys thought, oh no, you look hot. No! I, would, I can't be offended by that. Right, I'm you can't be offended myself. if you ask for it. That's why I don't do it, because I'm like that's, that. That's why I was bringing it up, I because it. I hate it when people do that. What'd you say? <laughs> so, attention seeking horse, right? He said attention seeking horse. Right? Said, seeking well, I understand asking one question, but after I constantly say I'm not going to answer the question, you keep asking more questions. But not you, I think you already broke the seal, though. I feel like you broke the seal. Thank you, little John. I was just wondering. All right, so uh, so apparently you have a right to be offended if you ask for someone to ask you questions, and then they ask you questions you don't want to ask, you don't want to answer. They're asking too many questions. They're asking too many questions. Okay. Okay. How about this? Yeah. Next time, let's put a limit. Be like, ask me a question, but only one, and no follow up. Bet. Okay. It's okay now. Everyone on the internet will know too. Freeze eating in public. Freeze eating in public. Take a bite. Look, we're gonna get over this fear. There it is. <laughs> Welcome to ASMR chicken eating with John. Right? Oh, get it, little dog. Dougie, what'd you get? You want some beans? <laughs> okay. I got tacos. Of course, Santa getting the fries, as always. There you go. Beans for your thoughts, Tim. Yeah. Looks so disappointing. Oh. All right, so now that we're done here, we're going to, uh, James is going to the mall, and we're going to go find the hotel. Yep. And then I'll meet back up and do something. Food here was really good, though. Come to Lucy's. Yeah, I'm afraid. Hello, John. How was your food? It was amazing. Dougie, how are your custom tacos? Anna with the french fries. Yeah, my stuff is pretty good too, so uh, to the hotel. You got that? Thanks. All right, so we got a room at the La Quinta. It was only like 150 bucks for the night, so. It's not as big as the rooms that we're used to, but it's actually, it's not bad. Let's do a, a quick once over since I didn't do one on the other hotel. James and Bree down at the mall and then head to the beach I think and this one had to change outfits like 4,000 times yeah so James we're late and it's her fault sorry 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 James I love you James yeah I'm so sorry yeah I don't I didn't want to be like this sorry. typical <laughs> How would you rate Biloxi Beach? At the moment, probably about a 2 out of 10. 2 out of 10. A whole 3 and a half. 3 and a half. Three. 2. 2 out of 10, 2 out of 10, 3. Yeah, I'll give it a, I'll give it a 2 and a half to be fair. Whoop. These people's uh, umbrella went flying and it actually flew all the way back and hit our cars. It's really windy. You probably can't hear any of this. We chose a spot next to the dead fish. <laughs> we felt bad for him, he needed company.
right, so we're back at the hotel, but it's dark, and um, I don't think we're gonna go swimming tonight. We ended up going to the mall and doing some running around and getting a few things and just kind of enjoying the fact that it was sunny outside and that we had the top off on the Corvette. So, uh, yeah, came back here, got ready, and uh, we're gonna go get dinner somewhere now. So, Anna's trying to find a place. Anna, what'd you find? Um, all the stuff that I can find we have in, like, Laurel. You don't like seafood. No. Your stomach doesn't like seafood. Alright, so, um, we're gonna try to find some food. I'm gonna bring the camera in case we see any cool cars or if anybody's meeting up tonight. I think usually people meet down here at Sonic on Saturdays or Fridays or something, so eh, it might be worth a shot. So, yeah, let's go. Alright, so it's the next morning and we ended up, we went and got food and stuff last night, but honestly we were just kind of like enjoying being out on the town and I didn't record a whole lot. But this morning, um, Anna has to be at work at 11. It's supposed to take an hour and 45 minutes to get there from here and it's eight o'clock right now she still has to get to the house change clothes get ready for work which she normally does about 9 30 so that means we have an hour and 30 minutes to get there and we've still got to finish packing so yep yeah, i'm gonna get on that your alarm didn't go off this morning mine did i woke you up she's trying to blame me for the fact that it's now 8 20. Okay, so anyway, it's 8.20. Uh, we got to make it home by like 9.30 so that she can get ready because it takes her somehow an hour and a half to get ready um, for work. That's the only reason. Because she's a girl. She has long hair. It takes forever. Anyway, um, yeah, so what we're going to do is see how fast we can make it from Biloxi, Mississippi to Laurel, Mississippi without getting pulled over by the police. Yes. You're She's not wrong, you know. Why would it feel like that instead of not when I had to be at work? Sorry, I'm a girl. Yo, look like a man. <gasps> I hate you. Stop. <laughs> Somehow we, we have more room than we started with. So uh, either we did a better job of loading or we we forgot something. And she bought stuff while we were down here, so I don't know. Do I want to what? I said, do you want to stop by McDonald's? By McDonald's? Of course. But we're late. 8.30. But she has to have McDonald's. If we're late. It's not my fault. Oh, it's definitely your fault. You took so long. <laughs> a freaking shower. She was still getting ready when I got out of the shower. Stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> Truth. Dude, what are you doing? Bruh. Bruh. Sorry, is she a YouTuber? I am. You are? Yeah. Oh yes. my god, that is so cool. Ah, wait. What's your name? Alexis. Hey, Alexis. This is Alexis. <laughs> Alexis is going to be our newest subscriber. Yeah, what's your name? I just wanted to see somebody in person vlogging. Yeah, <laughs> that was Alexis. I like her. She likes YouTubers. Yay. Alright, bad part about Corvette. You have no freaking room. <laughs> I freaking told you. He doesn't listen to me. Look at that. Alright, thank you much. Never listens to me. Look, they tried to break in. Is this how we get home? There's the puppers. <gasps> All right, so we're on the road. We got our McDonald's and everything. We got like an hour and 30 minutes is how long it's supposed to take. And I need to do it in one hour. It's 8.37, time to arrive at the house. 9.45, I think I can do it. And it says it's a Corvette, so we can do it, right? Alexis, thank you. You actually really subscribed. Alexis, subscribe. So, uh, 
Yeah. a minute ago we were doing like 92 and a 60 but I think he just didn't care so all right stay tuned for the next video and um, say hi to Anna again she might be in the next one if she doesn't irritate me too much oh. all right thanks for watching uh, thanks to my newest subscriber Alexis from the McDonald's in Biloxi and you guys go by and see her and tell her what's up all right Give me a meh. Meh. There it is. Are you ready, bitch? Oh. <laughs> Am I ready? Alright, so we just now. All right, so we just. All right, so we just. Okay. All right, so we just. Shut up, Anna! I'm trying to close out from earlier. All right, so we just got back to. I love you. I love you, Tim. All right, so we just got. Shut up. All right, so we just got back to the hotel. No, I'm laying down. That's done. Ended up. We we. What did I say earlier? We were gonna come back and go swimming. It was all lies.